So Zach Ertz is available, and reports have it that the 49ers are interested, and I think that Zach Ertz would be interested as well. Grew up in Danville, went to Stanford. Jim Harbaugh actually recruited him to Stanford, and then I think it was Trent Baalke who drafted Vance McDonald over Zach Ertz in 2013. That turned out to not be the right call, but obviously Baalke is now in Jacksonville, and this is a new era. 49ers and Kyle Shanahan, he's, he's been a fan of Zach Ertz's for some time. Now, Ertz is not in his prime, and if the 49ers do bring him in, it wouldn't be for a major role. But, but they don't need anybody to take a major role. They got plenty of weapons. I think this would be more of a locker room signing. Somebody, I mean, Zach Ertz has caught the winning touchdown in the Super Bowl back in 2017 for the Philadelphia Eagles against the New England Patriots to beat Tom Brady. So, uh, I mean, we saw it with Logan Ryan the other day. The 49ers brought in a player who's not going to be a starter, but somebody who's won two Super Bowls. Who's been there and done that. And I think that's, for this 49ers team that's so loaded with talent right now, that, that's the priority. And that's all that you're going to get at this point, too. You're not going to have superstar free agents waiting around to sign with teams in December. But you will have veterans who are obviously past their prime but can contribute to the culture of the team contribute to the meeting room and in the case of Zach Ertz 49ers just lost Ross Dwelly to a high ankle sprain he's going to be out for a few weeks they have plenty of return from IR activations they could put Ross Dwelly on injured reserve sign Zach Ertz and Dwelly has been giving them anywhere between three to ten offensive snaps a game you already have a blocking tight end in Charlie Werner you already have your superstar tight end in George Kittle that dwelly role, though, somebody with the body control of Zach Gertz, somebody who could really catch the football, obviously a better receiver than Dwelly or, or Charlie Warner have ever been, even at age 33. Uh, you know, th th this could be something that works for the 49ers. Plus, you keep him away from the Philadelphia Eagles, who are probably interested in reacquiring him. So, Zach Gertz, not a bad idea for the 49ers if he wants to jump aboard. By the way, his wife went to Santa Clara University, Julie Ertz, played soccer for the U.S. Women's National Team. Zach uh, met her while he was at Stanford. Julie was down in Santa Clara. Obviously, it's where the Fort Anders play. Santa Clara is where Levi Stadium is. And uh, their first date was at Chipotle, of all places. That's the legend. Maybe Zach Gertz can add to it by finishing his career with the 